This is Ari and welcome to Reactions. Today I'm going to be reacting to Star Wars The Last Jedi Awake trailer. And this is a 45 second trailer and I've kind of stayed away from a lot of the trailers because I'm just really excited for the movie and I just wanted to hurry up and come out. Mm, so yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I just wanted to hurry up and come out. So um, I'm going to watch this one because it's only 45 seconds. So. Anyway, let's see what this trailer has in store for us. Oh, that's Ooh. That's the only way to become what you were meant to be. Darkness rises. And light to meet it. I need someone to show me my place oh. in all this. seconds is enough for me um they packed a lot of good clips in that to get you really pumped uh luke on the i like that opening shot of luke going uh, into the cockpit on the millennium falcon oh it's just like nostalgia old times he's looking like oh that brings back memories um it looks like yeah, um, Phasma may have a bigger role in this, which I'm excited about because I thought um, her character got a little wasted in um, the first one. Um, and uh, yeah, I wasn't as excited about the title at first for The Last Jedi, but now I'm really feeling it. And it really feels that we're going to have more of that darkness and that like depth that we had in the second film of the original tri trilogy which is also my favorite film of the entire series the empire strikes back so this has some empire type echoes to it i can feel it you know even though they yeah they're they're giving us that imperial march vibe in the music so definitely i feel those empire type echoes and I'm thinking yes this is going to be the uh, pivotal film in this new trilogy um, yeah and it's and we're gonna get we're gonna get to see a lot of Luke and Luke isn't gonna be that wide-eyed farm boy we you know we last saw well he was a seasoned Jedi when we last saw him in Return of the Jedi but he still had some of that that goodness and that that strength and that um you know that hope in him even even you know in the end you know when he's going to uh battle his father he's going to battle Darth Vader and he's going to save everyone <laughs> he still had some little hope even though he was a seasoned Jedi and he you know he'd completed his training according to Yoda even though we don't I mean we can go into extended universe stuff, but, <laughs> but yeah, he completed his training and he was a seasoned Jedi and he had, he lost some of that wide-eyed wide farm boyishness, but he still had hope. And this Luke, we see he is old, he is haggard, he looks disillusioned, he looks like he has seen some shit, and I think that, um... I think what we saw in the first film, it looks like that was a preview to a future. So maybe, so it looks like when uh, Ray was holding the lightsaber in the first film, we saw a flash forward. And I think there are a lot of theories out there. I've stayed away from those theory videos too. And I don't want to like spoil it for a lot of you too, you guys who have stayed away from those theories as well. I'll just touch on that because it was shown in the trailer that battle scene 
And so it looks to be like that may have been a flash forward. I don't know. We'll have to see when the movie comes out if it is a flash forward or if they're showing us a flashback of a battle. But um, yeah, I am I'm excited. And let me know what you thought about this in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Remember, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, visit our website, geekgirlworld.com, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more reactions. Bye!